A wheelchair user can't have a chair that's very agile and very stable in the same unit. So what they end up with is an average, a chair that's not really very agile nor very stable. And this is where our new innovation comes into its own. I'm going to switch my chair to intelligent mode. Now the chair will move its centre of gravity with me. As I move forward, it moves forward. As I move back, it moves back. My centre of gravity and the chair's centre of gravity are now the same. Even subtle movements, the chair will track, so I can't overbalance. For me, this is a really exciting aspect of the project. For the first time ever, the wheelchair is not an inanimate object. It's intelligently interacting with me. My centre of gravity and the wheelchair's centre of gravity have become one. That means I get amazing agility and stability. Pushing on the road, there's noticeably less vibration. The chair is always finding the lightest stable position. And I've got total synchronicity with the chair. The wheels are right where I want them. If I'm leaning back, I don't have to reach forward to get to the wheels. And if I'm leaning forward, I don't have to reach back to get to them. They're right there where I need them. I can switch the chair into manual mode. This gives me total control of where I want the centre of gravity. This is really useful for the times I need to deliberately lift the front wheels off the ground, like this pavement. This chair could be the beginning of a whole new generation of smart wheelchairs. And it looks really up to date. You know, we've tried hard to make the shape very ergonomic, naturally fitting the body with no straight lines, no right angles. Feels good. Let's go. Easy. So I could put the brakes on, but I find on buses and trains it's better to let the chair roll back and forth with the motion of the train. And with the CG moving back and forth with me, I'm staying stable, which is pretty cool. Normally on a train, I'd really be concerned about falling backwards all the time. But I'm really not. I mean, this is no hands, the train's moving. I'm totally stable. I prefer to wheelie down ramps, so we'll switch to manual mode, giving me full control of the CG. Great. The chair is adjusting its centre of gravity all the time. It doesn't care whether the weight's added by a bag on the back or just by me shifting my body weight around. So when I take the bag off the back of the chair, the centre of gravity will adjust accordingly.